今天的干爹是新手爸妈一定认识的小狮王辛巴，他们家的奶瓶从新生儿到大人都可以用哦，也是 Ken 跟 Ivy 给宝宝用的奶瓶。没骗你，真的超好拍嗝，连我都拿来当水杯用。而且我跟你说，月子中心他们也很推荐哦。你为什么要抢宝宝的奶瓶？<笑><笑>教徒们快买起来！从现在到十一月底，小狮王辛巴最厉害的孕蜜铂金奶瓶加一元多一件，结账时输入百灵果专属折扣码一一一一四个一哦，再享全馆八九折，快去下单吧！ Welcome to Catching Up. This is Peggy. This is Kylie. This is Ken. Oh my God! This is the first time we're doing an English show together. <laughs> I know we've been talking about this for a long, long time. I keep postponing it. <laughs> yeah, no, it's because me. I, I gotta apologize because、uh, my wife just gave birth.、Uh, yeah, congratulations!、Uh, it's my. It's our first first child. I was、mm-hmm. really nervous. You know, I was standing in front of her. You know, when the baby was. Delivering, like、mm-hmm. I, I found her vagina, right? Yeah, I was in front of her vagina. <laughs> no, I saw, I saw. Was that like really moving or a little traumatized? No, I'm. I was it not was traumatized. Cool,、right? It was really cool.、That's、I was、cool. really moved. I, I kept crying. No, it didn't freak you out at all. No, because、no. some guys said that they got freaked out. I was right, like, why? Right. It's why? A really, it's, it's a beautiful thing. thing. It's, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, there are guys fainted. I've heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, seriously, because <laughs>、wow. like some hospitals don't let husbands go in because like、so, uh, husbands will only yeah they need extra people to take care of. Husband, yeah, exactly.、Mm, seriously. So that's why a lot of hospitals don't let husbands in. Oh, that's But,、uh, interesting. But I was just there, you know. I I caught. Were、them. you worried that you you might like faint it? No, 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 no. Oh, I was, that's cool. I was like there all the way, and I was okay. Like, I was really happy to catch Le- Leia when she was born. Oh, But, nice. What? But like. Her water was all over me though. That、like, it just gushed out.、Oh, Did know, you get excited? I don't know. I'm just sorry. No, no, no. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? What's、I'm、wrong、sorry. with you? What's wrong with you, Patty? Are you okay? But yeah, I was really happy. But we're both so tired. I of course. But I shouldn't be this tired. But I'm just tired. I don't know why.、Mm-hmm. It has nothing to do with. I mean,、nothing. it has something to do, do with you. Do but、anything. you didn't do any labor. I didn't do anything. I just kept eating. No, no. He, he 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 cried, and that's really exhausting. <laughs> also, I think the adrenaline when the adrenaline yeah, boost, yeah. Yeah. it will、oh, make、so、you feel、nice. better. Yeah,、that. she just want to bash me. I know. Thank you, Peggy. You're so nice. Let's、oh. yeah, so. bash her together. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You guys are so sweet.、Uh, so Peggy, like before we started, you were saying that.、Uh, oh, just to let everybody know, Peggy's、uh, celebrity kind of. No, in I, I am no. not. But you're on TV from time, right? Traditional media. Sorry, we just. But you're going to be judged so much. <laughs> but, 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 you're, but, yeah, but you're on I TV. I turned on the TV. I saw you on TV all the time. I'm being really pretty, talking about your family background. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm、Can、actually not、really、on the、family. TV that often now. Why? 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 You used to、Did、be on TV really often.、Someone? Yeah. Did you not sleep with the right people? <laughs> 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 no, I think it got to do with、um, doing social media, like having my own platform to say whatever I want. But your agency don't like that. Uh, yeah, you're too out there, and then I think TV you're too arrogant. Shows... You became too arrogant, like you don't want to、no, follow、I'm、their not... instruction anymore. No, 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 no. Not well behaved. I'm not <laughs> arrogant. I'm just very verbal. No, not what verbal. Like verbal? I, I like to、verbal? talk about things in bed. I'm sorry. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> no, but I just、um, I have strong opinions towards certain things, like and like politics, war,、um, like the current events. Sorry, like you have opinions about current events or、uh, or, or whether Taiwan is a country,、oh, things like this. Oh, like sensitive so topics. So when people, yeah, those、media. are they would consider this as more sensitive. So they don't like me to say things like this. Or when people say, "Oh, are you ABC?" and I would, I always want to correct them as ABT. Yeah, from no, Thailand, right? <laughs> <laughs> you studied in Thailand yeah, for a little bit. Yeah, I thought that's what you meant. Yeah, what? That's what you meant. That's what she meant. Now she's like offended. What's wrong with being like no, associated I'm with proud, Thailand? I'm proud of that, but yeah, yeah. So those are things. Okay, so for example, like last week we just did a show, and they were asking like, "Oh, have you ever got bullied during your time when you're studying abroad?"、So、yeah, from bilingual. No, exactly, exactly. No, they were asking when I was studied in、no. Thailand. I say no. Actually, I'm the bully. <laughs> <laughs> so, said, so usually they'll give you a topic that、yeah. they're talking about, and、yeah. they want you to provide some stories. Yeah. And so the stories that I gave was, oh no no, actually I'm I'm quite popular in the class,、yeah. and I you're have you're the popular girl, you're the mean girl, the mean yeah. <laughs> in, in, in a way, in a way, okay okay. Let, let me finish the story.、Okay. So I said, okay, so when during Taiwan's National Day,、uh-huh. National、yeah. Day, I I I printed out all these little flags and spread it、uh, in、okay. class and let people 
put it on their face. Oh, that's, oh, that's cute. cute. So it's like kind a of a tattoo. Oh, like, yeah, uh, yeah, like yeah. FIFA. You know, people always yeah, have yeah, those yeah. flags on their oh, face. That's cute. And I give it to my Swedish friends, British friends, all kinds of oh, nationalities. Awesome. Yes. And the teacher would even ask, like, oh, do we have any event in the school today? And I'll just raise my hand and say, no, it's Taiwan's National Day. And no Chinese people in the class say a single shit. Oh, nice. I think it's a really good story because yeah. a lot of stories that people are telling when they're in the States or in Canada, yeah. it's always like they got bullied or people yeah. are really mean to Asian. Yeah. So I think this is a really good story. But of course, this is not the kind of story they wouldn't let me talk about on so the show. So did you talk about it on no, TV? No, no, no. Oh. I, so that, that's censored. another thing. That's another thing. So um, there's still a hierarchy. I feel oh. like so. Okay. What do you mean? What kind uh, of a hierarchy? Okay, who's the top? Um, people who've been in the industry longer. Oh, so you're the, talking about celebrities, wise. Yes, I, I would call them entertainers. Okay, entertainers. Celebra- yeah. So, okay. um, the longer they are here, the more respect they get. Okay. But for me, I respect a person because of their talent, not because they've been in the industry. Sounds, sounds like so you, you won't you survive in this like, industry. <laughs> they've been there forever. Doesn't mean they have talents. That's what you're saying. Uh, no. Uh, so how did they survive on TV for this long? I don't understand. Who did they sleep with? No, <laughs> I, I feel like they have their group of audience that really enjoy listening to them. But uh, I enjoy being on the internet and just... Say whatever you just like. Just being yes. real, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. Oh. But uh, you're currently uh, signed to a traditional agency, right? Not an internet agency. Traditional <laughs> Agency, agency. Well, yeah, I have yeah. an agency. Um, mm-hmm. But before, but they that, usually have connection with the TV shows and stuff. Not yeah, like that's the, how they got you onto t- uh, different TV programs, right? Uh, yeah, and actually, my my boss is the producer of that show. And so that's, that's why, how you got mm-hmm. into the TV yeah. show. Uh, if yeah. you don't, if you are not signed on with this kind of agency, you would never be able to be on TV. Is that mm, what you're saying? No, actually not. Um, the first time I was there. I I was oh, I had an agency before, but that was modeling agency, so it's kind of different. Mm. So that was the previous agency. So I was before with that, you were with the modeling agency. Modeling agency. Yeah. What's the difference between a modeling agency and so, a celeb- uh, entertainer agency? <laughs> I'm sorry. So, show business. Uh, yeah. yeah. I don't know. Um, I think a lot of models would hate me for saying that, but that's also why I decided to leave the agency. What are it's you going to okay. say about the models? I don't, think, I don't yeah. think models understand I what you're saying right now. M- models are more <laughs> more like just close hanger. People know you not because of you, mm. but you don't people don't really know you as your personality or who you are, what you what your thoughts or mm. like your your charisma, yeah. but more just because of how your body shape, your skin color. Mm. And I'm not favored because I'm tan, I'm chubby. Uh, comparing to what all those, fuck? all those Sorry. other girls, I feel offended. Right? <laughs> she was like, compared to both of you, I'm not chubby. <laughs> you fat. No, no, no. Comparing to comparing to all those girls on the show, because that's what they they said to me every time I'm I'm on the show. Oh. My my boss would just like walk to my side and say, "I think you need to work out more." Oh wow! Or, oh, wow. Yeah. Was that, how old were you when you signed to those modeling uh, that agencies? Was, I was with another agency when I was in Bangkok, so. That uh, was what? around 20. Like in college? Yeah, that is just a side job. But I didn't really get a lot of jobs because, again, you in Bangkok, in they have… Oh, you signed to a company in Thailand? Yeah, in I, had, Bangkok. I had a modeling agency back then when That's I was so in cool. university. That's so cool. It's just a part-time job. But, but I what didn't was really it like? Get... Like, to, is, like? Now you're being mm-hmm. the Thai agency and a Taiwanese uh, modeling agency. What's Is What's there the any difference? culture difference? I think it's pretty much the same. Oh, really? Because they're doing the same so thing. So they treat you… Both of them treat you like clothes hanger. Uh, but they appreciate… That's how they… Yeah, co- skin color more they in Thailand, don't, right? They, they, don't, don't. they don't. They, they, they still because want you to be white. Because they're all tan, so they're all looking up to those white girls. They like uh, you to be more uh, pale, you know? Yeah. So that's why I'm not favored in, yeah, they, in that industry. They, they really like fair skin models, yeah. right? Yeah. Then oh. Why did you want to be a model so much? Like you signed to two modeling agencies. Uh, it's just fun to, I think, because… It's easier to make money with your face. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just saying. <laughs> no, 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 no. Actually, tutoring makes money faster. Then why did, you, then why did you sign up with modeling agencies? We don't because get it. They just say like, talk shit to you all the time, anyway. Yeah, yeah like you're that, fat. That's true. You're not doing well. Yeah, that's what we heard. Yeah, yeah, it, 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 is, it is true. It is true. So constantly, even when you want to change your hair color, you have to ask your agency, hey, I want to change my hair color. Is How it okay? How much they pay you to say so much shit about you? But because you're the close hanger, you don't get to have your own look. Yeah. They oh, want see. the look that they want. Um, they want I, the look that the mm-hmm. brands that 
The, yeah, the with favor. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so I see. I see. So I don't think it's their fault. It's the brand. It's the fashion. It's the market. Fashion, <gasps> it's it's the market. fashion yeah. industry's yeah, fault. Yeah, I think. Oh, because it's the same as, you know, how um, Victoria's Secret got judged or people yeah. are dissing them because how they only favor super skinny girls. Yeah. Yeah. But I think there's always different standards. You know, mm. previously people prefer girls a little bit more plump. Yeah. With what ads, is plump? Um, round. Curvy. Oh, curvy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. curvy. So with, with ass, with boobs. With boobs. Yeah. yeah. So… Now, these days, people like girls like that. But before, they wouldn't get any opportunity. Oh, I see. But yeah. you say that in the model agency, they don't really look at what you're thinking. They don't look inside, right? Mm-hmm. It's who you are. Yeah. But it sounds like now that you're with this entertainment agency, they don't want you to say what you really think about on the TV anyway. So how is that different? Uh, that's So, So <laughs> yeah, that's what I meant. It's a... <laughs> Okay, I don't like people. Do you think to... your current boss gonna <laughs> listen to this? Are you gonna put on Mandarin subtitles? Uh, we, we, we can we cannot do shorts. it just for you for this episode. <laughs> okay, but be okay. like for no. protection for, for our friend okay. Peggy. I, I gotta be really honest. Like I definitely really appreciate all the opportunities that oh, he's yeah, putting course. me into. Yeah, like yeah, I, yeah. I truly yeah. truly appreciate that. Good, but also because I have like like what I said, I have very strong opinions on certain things. Where like previously when I was here talking with you guys. I don't have filter. So I think that just doesn't, I just don't fit in it in that industry. When everyone's super friendly, they're super nice, there's a but hierarchy. But don't you think they're fake? <sighs> Is it is it true that it's hard to make like real friends there? Because everybody kind of like be friendly because they don't want to offend anyone. And you need to be really nice even though you don't like the person you are talking to. Is that real? I would say in a way, yes. But it also got to do with me personally because I'm kind of social phobic. Phobic. <gasps> What? what? I know. I know it's hard to are tell. Are you saying that you're a loner? Kind of. Are you introvert? I'm more of are an you, introvert. Yeah. You are what? an introvert. Okay. That is why what? I only Just talk to you. First time listeners. <laughs> like, I'm like little last chubby. Time, I'm an introvert. Last time Peggy was on our show, she was like the Tinder queen. Okay. Yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> well, you only need to talk to one person at a time. You know, you don't need to talk oh. to a whole group of people. And whenever I want to leave, I just go. Oh, that's true. Then you're like oh me. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. yeah. I don't feel really comfortable with a bunch of strangers. Mm. Yeah. I always, always hide behind behind Ken. Me. <laughs> I always look for something to 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 do. You oh. know, like try to t- try to act like I got something on my hands. I always have my laptop with me, so that I'm always working with my AirPods, so I don't need to talk to anybody. Oh, I didn't know you were an introvert. Because like, every time I we am. talk to you, you, you always talk seem a lot very, and drunk, yeah, and then and have a lot of. Energy I actually have the you. flask in my bag before <laughs> I came, because yeah. I, yeah, I get stressed out easily. You wanna take a so. shot now? I'm awkward around people too, but I I have this. He, he switch has though. a switch. I have a in- internal switch. It's like I have social mode. I just turn on social mode. <sighs> So, I have that too, if you yeah. can tell. Like I can act for yeah. a certain time, but after probably two hours, yeah, I'll feel really, really exhausted, yeah. and I just really gotta go. I used that all my social energy when I was in my uh, doing MBA, right? Yeah, and then after that, burned out for two years, and then and then now I'm <laughs> done for. I, I have no <laughs> for more the rest social of the mode. life. Yeah, <laughs> I have no more social mode. But if it can last for two two, two years, years, that's really long. Yeah. Yeah, that's what she said. Anyway, is that, why, <laughs> is that is that why you guys didn't go to the the award, the YouTube award? Uh, um, oh, the the is that the reason? Yeah, so there, it. there's a, a YouTube award in, in Taiwan, Taiwan that it's really important stuff for all the YouTubers in yeah. Taiwan. It's called Walk Bill. John the word. Mm-hmm. It doesn't matter the translation. It's, it's a weird so, translation. It sounds so bad in English. Like, I know. They, did he re- I think that's did the whole organizer point. thought about this? I don't think so. But in Chinese, in it Chinese sounds pretty sounds cool. It sounds really cool. It's yeah. cool, right? But I don't know why they translate it into this because English. It's want, so hard for me to like explain because to foreign friends. John is the same sound as the Chinese, right? Zhou Zhong Jiang. Really? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Oh my God. I, John. 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 John right? Walk bell. Do, John. John. But I yeah. think that's what they want. They want it to be a little bit silly, a bit goofy. That yeah. people get okay. a bit confused. But, but it's so I, hard yeah, to I, I pronounce think and remember. The organizer forgot that as the the award gets bigger, it's harder to use this name if you want to invite people from you know overseas, right? Can you imagine yeah. Mr. Beast receive an invitation from Walk Bell John Award? 
Oh well, yeah, of course. Even... Hey, he even named himself Mr. B. <laughs> <laughs> he probably wouldn't care. But anyway, <laughs> that's true. That's true. So this is the biggest uh, YouTube awards or or you know online entertainment award. I don't mm-hmm. know how how should you say it? YouTube I don't know, award. YouTuber. Yeah, yeah YouTuber uh, award. An award Taiwan, for right? YouTuber. Yeah. Yeah. And Kadi and I this year we are on the we're committee, really right? Busy. But yeah. we're so busy this year. I right? did. Couldn't I really go. wanted to go, but now this time they were organizing Kaohsiung, mm-hmm. so it basically take at least two days or sometimes three days to be able to stay there for the whole time. Yeah. And I wouldn't be able to do it. Right. Yeah, me yeah. neither because my wife is pregnant. Right, right. Yeah, like yeah. Last, week, like, yeah, yeah. last week. She's so gonna, I, she was gonna give birth at a, any, any moment. Time, any that, moment. That week, right? So yeah. it was, I, I felt really bad not going because I was like, because she I has, said, he has won the award. So yeah, yeah, I won the award. Yeah, yeah. First of all, I won an award. And I knew about it beforehand. You yeah, when did you know? You, you I, know yeah, before him. Because did you tell him? No, no. Okay. I was I didn't so know. I didn't nice. Know okay, so we were in the organizing committee, so yeah. we give a lot of advice and try to help out. I mean, we didn't do a lot of things. We just like we, speak. Yeah, we just <laughs> give our opinions. That's <laughs> yeah, it. that's it. That's it. You guys do it. Yeah. I think my opinion is so good. <laughs> so uh, I knew that uh, you got the award beforehand because they want to make sure that they can call Ken mm. at the ceremony. Mm-hmm. So it's cute, right? Oh, right. I'm with my pregnant wife. I really want to go. Thank you so much. That kind of stuff. Right. Yeah. But they were a little worried because it's going to be in the weekend. It was going to be in the weekend. Mm. They didn't know that if your wife was be, would be okay with that. It, are you going to be okay with that? So they were like double checking with me, yeah. the status. So I promise it's going to be fine. Just give him a reason and tell him that we're going to call you because you're in the committee. Uh-huh. Yeah. I'm in the committee too, but they're not going to call me. So <laughs> yeah, It was really, a little bit weird when I they thought told you me. Were, yeah. I thought you kind of would find out. No, I didn't. Because oh. they didn't say anything, they just say, "Oh, because I they're gonna let all the members on the committee say something on the show, yeah. right?" And because I was not there, so they they say, "Just keep your phone open." They will oh. call me, right? Yes. So I was waiting the whole time. They were time. so I, worried. Said, "How can we make sure that Ken is on with his phone?" Right, that, right. During I, that time, I would be there watching so the we, whole live stream because yeah. I I was. Then how you know, come they didn't call you? No, they, they did, did call me. They, but, they did, but because. We didn't do any rehearsal because mm-hmm. I came out and asked. They, uh, they told me on the messenger in right. the morning saying that, hey, just be ready in the evening. I said, mm-hmm. okay, uh, should we rehearse so we know that how things will work out, the sound They can rehearse. Be okay. And Otherwise, then, you and then you just get like, they went radio silence until 9 p.m. that night. At night, I was like, what the hell? Right. And then they call all of a sudden. I turn off the TV because mm-hmm. I, I, I don't want any echo. I thought, oh, okay, this is time. Right. I turn off the TV and there's no sound you, on my messenger. You, you overprepared, that's why. Yeah, I over. <laughs> <laughs> you can just like, use your phone. Wait, everything's like, wait, gonna work wait, out. Wait, and and nothing. I f- I I, I look like an idiot. Yeah, on the he show. looks like an idiot I, on I, the I watch show. The replay, I replay. I look like an idiot. Everything was live stream. Like she was. He was a wait, 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 but no sound. Yeah. Yeah, I feel so. But bad, we're so but. happy Aww. for you. Yeah, I was yeah. really happy that I got the award. So many good he news. He got the award for shorts. For shorts, yeah, shorts. It's to share um fu- a food reel that I made uh, in, earlier in this Japan. Year. But yes. we are Taiwanese. But his uh I, food I, porn in Japan yeah, yeah, got I, really famous. Yeah, I got a lot of views for my uh, Japanese restaurant uh, yeah. videos. Right, so a lot of people like it and. That video was about this old guy. You know, he makes a like, grape custard pudding, mm-hmm. and he has been doing it for sixty years. Yeah, so it's really cool. But I'm just happy that I got the award. But anyways, but Peggy, you know, is a somebody on yeah, Instagram she, yeah, a lot. Yeah, she, you, she made she, a lot of really lot good of shorts, shorts, right? To teach English, yeah. to be how come, entertaining. How come I didn't see any nominations? Yeah, of you? Did you submit your videos this year? I totally missed that. You missed I missed all you the information. Your agency didn't help you with that? Nobody, nobody <laughs> oh reminded you. Okay, I'm my own producer. I'm my own editor, my own videographer. My Yeah, I do everything. Everything on Actually, social media is yeah, on your own. Yeah. Then why did you need to sign uh, to a traditional media that doesn't do any help? Uh, <laughs> not exactly. Right? They sorry. still. It's not they, my first language. They, forgive me. <laughs> they still <laughs> help me to negotiate with clients, and they still help me with um, my exposure on on, on television. TV? Yeah, I, I can. Do people have watch that TV exposure too? So, do you have any friends that watch TV? I'm I, just curious. Actually, no, but I believe there is still a certain <laughs> group of people. You mean that old people? No, actually, young people. But that—that's what I thought. That's why I'm still with them. I want. I still. I want to. Extend like the target. You want to reach the people not, that not just that who don't use the internet. 
<laughs> then what's their value then if they don't use internet? They add so nothing to your brand. So I want to reach out to people. <laughs> I want to reach out to people um, that both using internet and watch TV. You yeah. want to reach? Oh, so yeah. you want to be famous across the board? Uh, Not like us. We just. We famous on the on internet. internet. Nobody Says knows about the person who just finished a TV show. <laughs> <laughs> that was an accident. <laughs> I was tricked. <laughs> and you actually got a lot of opportunity to talk on that show. And my thing is, I never really get to talk. So we we'll oh. prep so long. We did our makeup. We prep. I, I will get you close just from sponsorship, yeah. and we'll prep so many stories. And I never really get to talk. And I think oh. that's. It, any special reason? Because the hierarchy that I mentioned, they oh, would usually. Because you're too young, they, they only give up. And I'm new here. For them in the ah. industry, I'm still new. I'm no like yeah. Even though you have mm. like way more views than them on the internet, it's like not exactly one of my video can like take out three of you or five. Uh, that's when I'm working with you guys. The m- video that we we made together, yeah. But my own video, like yeah, eh, it was like what three million on. views on the internet. Yeah, at least mm-hmm. three million. Yeah, yeah including yeah. shorts, Instagram, probably yeah, yeah, more. You, you gotta add four them across mi- probably the board. Probably four yeah. million. YouTube plus Instagram plus and TikTok plus shorts. TikTok. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. There's another one that I made with Kylie that got really popular. Oh yeah, that one. All of oh, them, the three All the, one. All the yeah, videos yeah, yeah. that you guys made together did really well. Oh, that's true. Yeah, then we should, we should definitely million. make more. Yeah, yeah we should make more. more. We actually scheduled to make uh, another reels, but then typhoon hit. A uh, typhoon oh, yeah. hit. That's, that's too bad. That so happened we had to, to me change. Whenever I so to anyway, to that's beach. come back to the reason why Peggy didn't submit your yeah, videos I think you, to you made really great shorts or any other. Yeah, why don't you do it? Uh, you just missed out. You don't have any friends who are influencers. That also if, if you consider it as my friend, I see you guys as friends. So you you think it's our fault not <laughs> reminding you that hey, there's an award that you should submit your material to. No, no, I just really missed the whole information, and then I only realized this is happening till they already announced. See, the, the thing is that I didn't even nominees. know that you were interested in this kind of awards. Like, do I this thought you, all you want is to be on, on TV. TV. No. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> you want to be main. Do you curse on this thing? <laughs> yeah, of, yeah course of course I did. <laughs> <laughs> right? So, this so, is like a uh, small YouTuber award. So I thought you wouldn't care. The whole point of me putting myself out on no matter social media or TV, it's more, um, the whole reason is just to build my voice. Mm. So when, also like why we're doing this mm. and the whole reason that I'm doing um, Mandarin teaching to foreigners, mm-hmm. it's more like I want to reach out to more foreigners so that we can build our voice that more foreigners would listen to us when they're actually curious about what's happening here. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's good. So so provide a perspective from Taiwan. Yeah. yeah. Basically. Yeah. Okay. Okay, cool. Well yeah. let's start. Uh well I just want to share that I finished Jada Pinkett Smith audiobook this mm-hmm. week. And you finished the whole thing. I finished the whole thing. Whole Did you read 14, it? No, I, I listened to it. Oh. Whole 14 hour oh, that's of a lot. that book. It's really it's really long. Did you fall but asleep? I did. <laughs> no, for some parts, because like some of them just the I I like the beginning part, like when she was talking about her relationship with some of the celebrities mm-hmm. that she knew. Um, like Tupac. I know. I just learned that Peggy don't know who Tupac is. No. It broke Who's my Tupac? heart. Oh right? my god! Right? Well, you don't know Tupac. It's normal because you grew up in Taiwan, but she pretty much grew up in an English environment. Like, you I, do you listen I, to hip hop? I do. Is I listen to Snoop Dogg. Well, I know Snoop Tupac's Dogg. Tupac's like before Snoop Dogg. Uh, he's like, too young. But, but he, died oh, really, he died really young because oh. he, he died in a drive-by. Mm-hmm. He signed with like Death Row Record, you know, what that's Sugar Knight, you know, a notorious gangster who, mm-hmm. ran, who ran the label. But anyway, he was a really famous rapper, died really young. And Jada Pinkett Smith was like high school classmate with him. Oh, and wow. they had really this cool relationship that they had. And she wrote, she talked about this in, in her book. And I, I like how she shared a lot of intimate stories. But... For example? Um, oh, she also, she also she talk about... Did she talk about her threesome her, experience? Not threesome. She, uh, entanglement. Yeah, 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 entanglement. Yeah, entanglement with, with her, uh, mm-hmm. her son's friend. Alcina. Yeah, she talked about it. Oh, that's she cool. Kind of, she pretty much invented the word entanglement, right? I mean, it's, it's, it's usually not used in this yeah. way. But now everybody's like, yeah... I entangled with him or stuff like that, right? But anyway, she talk creepy. about it. She say she and Will Smith have this um, transparent re- uh, marriage mm-hmm. that they they would tell the other person what's going on with me, what's ah. what's happening right now, what I'm doing, you know. Mm. But she say they since 
2016, they pretty much have a divorce, not legally divorce, but right. like they're, they're doing, mm-hmm. yeah, they not, they, they, she don't use the word open marriage. Oh, it's, it's not too open cliche. Mar- <laughs> she she invented her own term. She said it's like a transparent marriage. Okay. So so they share everything. They talk about everything. And they're not Mary Mary, but they're mm-hmm. Mary. You know, legally married, but they're doing their own thing. Okay, and they will just report to each other. Okay. Yeah, I, I know I know I know with it's honesty, really weird. Uh, open yeah. marriage with honesty. And I just yeah. check online, the uh, I check the internet for her book review and some of them are really funny. You say, like, oh, just to give you guys a little bit of background. Uh, mm-hmm. Jada Pinkett Smith used to sell crack cocaine Ooh, on when? the street when, when, she, uh, when wow. she was little, when she was like 14, 15, uh-huh. wow. in, back in Baltimore. So this <laughs> this reviewer said, I love it. She sold me crack. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> so apparently this this person um, bought crack from, well, from well, okay. and Even loved if the book. <laughs> I don't really like her, but that person could just make that up, you know? Like, yeah, it could yeah, be. of course. People of course, these days on the internet. Come on, love, entertaining and message. the other one yeah, yeah. gave uh, wrote one of the most toxic women on this planet. Oh, oh yeah, mm-hmm. why? Does, a lot of people say that though. Yeah, right? that's like one of the most common review on on Google. I don't get it. There's even this comments on the internet saying Jada Pink, uh, Pinkett Smith, Meghan mm-hmm. Markle, and Amber Heard really are some of the worst wives of the 21st century. <laughs> worst wives. Of, but I, did she do anything? That's toxic. I mean, uh, I mean, she sold drugs, but I, probably because I, she needed to to yeah, survive. Yeah, because like back in Baltimore, everybody was yeah, doing it. Yeah, and she right? was young. Then, then what other than yeah, that? Yeah, I, I think she, she people gave her a bad name, but that's why I thought in the beginning, right? Yeah. After I finished the whole book, yes, I find her to be a little bit narcissistic. Even okay. though mm. in the book she says she learned about narcissism, I was like, what? How can you learn about narcissism and not know that you are a narcissist? I mean, that's but that's to, what narcissists are like. But to be fair, Will Smith probably has similar problem, right? Yeah, but Will Smith don't say that I learned about it and I fixed the problem and stuff like that, you know? Oh. Jada Pinkett Smith in the book, she came on saying that she was trying to learn lessons from everyone. Like, she, that every end of the chapter or, or a person that she talk about, she will say, oh, I learned this from her. I learned this lesson from my kid or so something like that. So she just loves to learn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I Only didn't read the book. I'm sorry. I, I, I hope so. And she always tried to find the truth of for life, right? Mm-hmm. And yeah. she she learned about a lot of religions. Like she she dabbled right. here and there. She learned mm-hmm. like about Buddhism, okay. Judaism, um, like Muslim, you know, but that's everything. Cool. But but she's like, she, she, the- she 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 trying to sound like a spiritual person. Okay. But Someone this, will use entanglement for but, an affair. But this book probably. is is not doing her justice. I don't. I don't think writing this book make her look good. Really? You know? So then that means she was being honest, right? Or she yeah. didn't even know that people wouldn't like her after re- reading her book? I, think I don't she... think she cares. Okay. She's yeah. like at this new stage of her life. She just like don't give a fuck anymore. Again, she's super rich, right? She yeah. have this show called Red, Red Table Talk. Yeah. And she got like 100 mil from Facebook. Alone, to, yeah, just for to that produce show? The, the show. And oh, the, the show, show was sponsored sh- by Facebook. Yeah, uh. they bought the show, right? A hundred mil, right, for a talk show that's set up in her <laughs> that, in her house. Okay, she doesn't even need to spend money on anything else. Uh-huh. Don't be too jealous. Okay? <laughs> well, she she made the Matrix, mm-hmm. so I, just still the whole thing. I was like, oh my god, a hundred mil. Yeah. We have a square, I'm um, a uh, rectangular table talk. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I don't know. My point for what you said that she she wouldn't really care what people think about her. I don't really agree with that because she definitely wants some attention. Mm. Otherwise, she wouldn't do the red table talk with Will first while they're separate but still legally married, mm-hmm. and later having published this book and then talked about their their marriage, <sighs> right? Well, she talked about this in her book too. Mm-hmm. I think it's kind of funny. She said she did this show with Will Smith uh, after the Alcina thing happened like two years ago, right? Mm. Um, anyway, mm-hmm. they 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 sat down on the table and they talked about this. And and she said Will Smith tried to spin the story okay. when they were like doing what? this table talk. And like, she said Will Smith became the victim and, and tried to so sound he like... Acted weak? Acted like a, a weak person in the relationship and act like he didn't know a lot of stuff even though they had a transparent rela- uh, transparent marriage. So she was a little bit mad inside but she was like, it's 
it's my fault because I was the one who invited Will to be on the show. I was the one making the show. And then after the whole thing was recorded, she said her publicist and her other friends said, don't, don't put this out there. But she said the gangster in her or something like that, you know, her, the Baltimore girl. Or in that her. attention seeker inside her. She said, I was the one who started it. I'm the one who is going to finish it. So she put it put the show up on the internet. I think they mm-hmm. just have a really fucked up marriage, period. <sighs> I don't know. I, I just think that if you are in that place in your life, you know, everybody in the world knows you. You have yeah. so much money and everybody around you asks you for money, for help. That's true. Then I think your world would be completely different. Like, I would not, I wouldn't say that I understand what she's going through because I can't. True. Like, she, a lot of her good friends die in front of her or, or, just like when she was, like for example, like Tupac mm-hmm. just got shot and they were best friends and she didn't even have time to heal the wounds and her other friends kill herself. Because like that's how she grew up. Like she grew up in Baltimore, right? So a lot of friends just like die and drive by, you know, just, you know, a lot of messed up stories. Yeah. yeah. And then you became like so big. Everybody knows uh, yeah, you. And, Whatever and, you and, do and, and say, yeah. people criticize you. Yeah, and you live in Hollywood, right? So every move you make, it's under the spotlight, yeah. And and she didn't. Re- and and in that life, you just keep have to go from project to project to project. You don't have time to sit back and just you know fix up the issues that you have that's piling up. I don't mm. know. That- For me, I saw one interview that she did with I think that was NBC News mm-hmm. exclusive. So when the host asked her, um, the host actually wanted to confirm mm. whether it's true that they separate in 2016. And then as the host was asking the question, she gave this really weird smirk, like, yep, yep. What? So if you're trying to fix this problem and invite it well to the Red Table Talk, and they make it sounds like they're working together through this marriage, Mm. and then now that she has this book released, and it sounds like she's just waiting for the good timing to, to show, to give people another... Um, juicy gossip and she's waiting for people to ask about this I don't know her, her face it's just her face that really makes her, makes me think that she's a toxic person um, they probably have to act in a certain way once mm-hmm. you're on that level so yeah so I, I think it's hard for them to find out who they really are when, true, they, are, true. when they are there yeah yeah and that's why like both of them did ayahuasca you know like Will Smith said that he did ayahuasca what is yeah. ayahuasca it's a um, <laughs> Well, it's a tra- tra- traditional herb from South America. It's uh, used in a lot of rituals. Ah, People drink those kind of water. Si si si, yeah. si si. You drink it and then you oh. see these visions. You know, you're, Where? You're Where spiritual. did they do that? Uh, I think Will Smith did it in South America. and <laughs> You look and a little too excited. Jada, <laughs> Jada, <laughs> Jada, <laughs> but, no, Jada it did it. Bit. Jada did it in mm-hmm. California. Mm. So apparently you can find spiritual guides in California and help you out if you want. But I, I'm sure this is illegal in California. I right? don't know if it's under the guidance, you know, a guidance of mm. medical use or, yeah, or, no or therapy. I don't know. I don't Certainly know. illegal in Taiwan, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, so they both did ayahuasca. They trying to go on this soul searching journey, and they yeah. in the end, both of them say that they found themselves. Once like, you get it, really famous, that there's something that you must do, like soul searching. Don't know who you are. Mm-hmm. You got too much influence. You, you already are so satisfied with your career and money you don't have to worry about money so you worry about anything else but money Kari, like, you are so famous now no, are no, you no, doing no, this? no 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 <laughs> I think I mean we are at the best best place stage, best, <laughs> best place stage. Like, we have a little fame but there's still so much more for us to st- to yeah, really work well. and then we still show. worry about the money <laughs> yeah. right so we, we don't oh worry God, about anything else we still born. worry about the money <laughs> we want to do so many crazy projects that cost a lot of money yeah I wish that Facebook can just give us a hundred mil. I know, mil. and then then we then we need to do soul searching if that happens. Yeah. Well, a hundred <laughs> mil Taiwanese dollars is okay too, you know. Oh, that's just true. Just to make 100 one mil. show, not US yeah. dollars. Oh, a hundred mil true. Taiwanese dollar. Yeah, we can burn probably show. that money. Is that a budget for one show, one episode? No, no, no. no, no the show, so. the series, ah, okay. the series. Right, right. I think it, it's, yeah, it's good money to use in Taiwan. Yeah, right? yeah. Like to make a lot of crazy shows. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I really want that. Hey. How do we end this? All right, this is catching up. I hope you guys like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst ending ever. But thank so leave you. a comment to let us know what let else do you want know. us to talk about, and we'll catching you guys up. I think we'll continue, right? We hope so. Hey, that's what? a really good ending, Peggy. I know. Good job. <laughs> <laughs>